Hi, my name is Professor Todd Wheeler. I'm here at Rapid Fitness Mixed Martial Arts Boxing Event Center. Next to me is Blake Riss. We're going to go over a real simple technique from closed guard called a Kimori. To start this position, I'm going to start at my closed guard. And I want to have my legs crossed. It doesn't matter which foot's on top. But I want to have a pretty good solid control of my opponent, my closed guard. We're going to start out with Blake having what's called chest and hip control. All right? So I'm going to attack the arm that's controlling my chest with the Kimura attack. I'm going to take my left hand, come under Blake's arm, and elevate it off of my chest. Then I'm going to rotate so my finger is now touching his wrist, and I bring it to the floor. All right, now I'm going to do what's called a monkey grip, so I'm controlling his wrist. All right, I don't want to use my thumb because I can possibly break it. Because his hand is controlling my hip, I'm going to be able to set up. So I want to make sure I'm moving prior to him transitioning his hand to my chest. So I'm now going to use my right arm and do what's called the baseball throw and bring myself up. Now if you wouldn't mind coming around here so you can see what's going on. I want to bring my chest right to his arm. Now as I'm sitting, feel free to open up your guard as you set up, but I've still got control of the wrist. I'm now going to bring my right hand come around so my wrist is coming right slightly above Blake's elbow and I do what's called a key lock. I grab my own wrist. Now, as I'm laying back, I'm gonna make sure there's a bend in his elbow and I lean back to my, to my back, all right? Now, I wanna make sure I'm keeping his elbow nice and tight to my chest. I don't want this floating around because I won't have the proper control of his arm because I'm trying to isolate Blake's shoulder so it's nice and tight. I'm having a 90 degree bend in his arm between his upper and his lower arm and I have my key lock grip. Now I'm going to do a little leg work. I'm going to extend my legs slightly, point my toes towards Blake's head and that will allow my hips to come out to my left. Now I'm going to point my toes back up to the ceiling and bring my left leg up his back. This will help me take more of a perpendicular angle to again further isolate his shoulder joint. So now you can see I'm perpendicular. I have control of Blake's elbow and now I slowly have to elevate his arm towards his head and he just submitted. All right. Another option I can do to increase the potential for pain is to control the wrist as I'm doing this at the same time, which creates a double submission. It's very painful. So we're going to go again. Hand clears. I set up. Lock off the key lock as I'm leaning back. Bend the arm. Point my toes. Perpendicular, elbow tight to my chest, and then I roll up or the double submission. All right, so that's the key lock, Kimura, from the closed guard. All right, stay tuned and we'll give you some more videos. Thank you.